So here we are at the Pirate 21, just listed on BoatshedWales.com. Thanks for taking a look at this walk around video. Here on the pontoons today in, as you can see, a very sunny Nayland in Pembrokeshire. Beautiful day. Clear blue sky for a change. So uh, unfortunately that does rather play havoc with the uh, light and shade and weird glints and reflections. Um, but nonetheless, we shall grab this video while we're here. And I am playing with my new toy, which is a gyro stabilized gimbal for me mobile. So far, so good. So I'll just generally walk around. Yeah, so Pirate 21, uh, 2017 model year. Oh, sorry, 2016, correction. I think she was put on the water in 17, but constructed in 16. Uh, engine uh, was at the same time was installed all brand new as a package and the trailer so the whole shooting match was handed over at that time engine hours for a five-year-old boat very low 75 don't have the engine keys on me uh, unfortunately for today I'm gonna get them when I do I'll uh, demonstrate the engine running but yeah she's absolutely sweet I've seen this boat out and about recently and uh, yeah she's fantastic so um, yeah I mean just needs a bit of a wash um, there's some dockside fendering that's been sat in the back there and uh, left a bit of dirt underneath it but I thought rather than waste time cleaning her for this I'll just get on with the shooting of the video. So, forward cuddy, very smart, very business like. We've got an HDS 7 low rants, obviously plotter, combo sonar, decent low rants, DSC VHF. And then some of the up, uh, optional features on this boat, um, for example, the twin windscreen wiper assembly. So both windows have got wipers. We've got the upgraded suspension chair, which makes long distance passaging much more comfortable. And she can do some distance. She's a really good sea boat. Um, not a hugely wide, widely known brand, the, the, the Pirate range. Uh, made by Howard from Pembrokeshire Yacht. So I, I happen to know the fella. They're built locally here to Nayland and um he's a very very keen fisherman in his personal life and uh you know knows what he's doing when it comes to a bit of fishing and a few nice touches so for example i rather like the twin battery arrangement there's a battery in there with an isolator and there is also a battery if i can work this camera there's also another battery in there with its own isolator as well i think that's a very nice arrangement wiring's excellent all neatly clipped up and everything um, it's also got it's also got the uh, stainless arch over the top with with rod holders. Quite a fancy piece of kit, is that? And rod holders, obviously, around the boat as well. And not least of which, we've got some live bait tank in the corners. One starboard and one on the port. Hydraulic steering, optional upgrade as well. A visible bulkhead filter, I think that's a good idea. See what's coming in through the through the filter housing. Rod holders and uh, boat hooks and brushes and such like. That's available on that rack there. Built in fuel tank. And um, yeah, she's got a big, big range on her. If driven economically. We've got two genuine beds as well, believe it or not. That's over well over six foot two, these berths. This one perhaps just a touch narrower because of the cutout for the for the footwell. But uh, yeah, two single berths in this cuddy. Um, on the floor, you can just about see there is a cockpit cover, um, which is a tonneau type cover. Handy for the marina. But it's a self-draining, fully washable deck anyway. So just stick the hose over it. Job's good, and she can stay out on a mooring, for example, as well. Because she's self-draining, no problem. And we've got good grab rails for the side deck here to go forward for anchoring or mooring. Nicely fitted windows everywhere. She's uh, she's a clean boat. She's a dry boat. She's low hours. And um, guy who owns her, Mark. Is a very competent boater himself, well-known local family, all of them boat mad, and uh, Mark, no exception. 
he knows what he's doing with the boat. He's looked after this one. He looks after all of his boats. and been dealing with him for many years. Just uh, notice that deck wash sticking out there. And also just, just in case the zombie apocalypse comes along. If you want to be an extra on Walking Dead, nice truncheon. So yeah, so we've got a, a, a clean boat, a lightly used boat, a good condition boat, which is excellent sea keeping qualities, really, really stiff on the water. And uh, yeah, very pleased to be listing this on BoatShedWales.com. Thank you for taking the time to look at this video.